Hello one and all, welcome to Seen Through Glass. Now, my dad's cars have been quite well documented on this channel over the years. During Drive the World, he called me up and said that he wants to sell his current Range Rover Sport because he read an article in the papers and has decided that all petrol cars are now worthless and he wants an electric or a hybrid. I told him to calm down. Things aren't quite that dramatic yet. He asked if I could help him out to find either a petrol car that is cheaper to own and run or more preferably an electric hybrid option. So I've come down to Urban Automotive's new Milton Keynes headquarters to meet up with Lenny. I don't really know why I'm doing this because every time I've come to Lenny for help finding a car for me or previously for my dad, he's taken me completely off track and just, yeah, he, this is gonna be a very nonsensical video trying to potentially find a car to replace my dad's current Range Rover Sport. Wish me luck. What is wrong with you? Every single time we do this, you take the criteria I've given you and throw it out of what is sometimes a metaphorical roof. In this case, we don't even have a roof. So, well, do you know what? I was actually quite surprised to see you because with this world tour, um, I thought someone would have kidnapped you by now, stuck you in a boot. And I mean, it's, it's, it's kind of nice to see ya. I feel there's a butt coming. <laughs> but I was surprised to hear yeah. that the, the, the world, um, you know, didn't swallow you up and... I thought I was going to be another Madeleine McCann. I, like, yeah, no, I, I, saw, thought, no, I saw that uh, coming yeah, for myself, yeah, if I'm honest. Yeah, so. absolutely. So, well, look, you know, your, your father's looking for a, a new motor and, um, you know, I, I throw a couple of swerve balls and sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. But with this Porsche, I just thought, well, look, you know, keep it in the Porsche family. Sorry, we've got a workshop. No, no, it's fine. Hey, we're, 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 we're in a working so, environment. Yeah, yeah. So apologies for the background noise. But yeah, so I've been back on an old construction <laughs> site now. <laughs> Shut off the drill, Ben. Is that what... <laughs> Ben? I didn't know a construction. Rupert. Rupert. Stop being so noisy. <laughs> What's well, like a good construction? Steve. Steve. That was a bit loud, wasn't it? Yeah. If I said Steve, do you think someone would stop? There'd be about three or four geezers out of back. What? <laughs> no, we don't have any Steve here. But no, I thought Porsche. Yeah, yeah your keep dad's it in the a, family. Your dad's a classy guy. And look, there's no, there's no sports car in the world as a better daily than a Porsche. Well, you know that, doing so many miles in it. You know. For sure, absolutely. And with my whole pitch, like keep him petrol for a bit longer. Cause I think we just, the electric hybrid thing, it's coming, uh, but it's not, it's, it doesn't need now, I don't right? think it's there yet, It's is not it? there the yet. The technology's not there yet. And this is a very advanced engine turbocharged yes. good on fuel so yes. i see the appeal but i can't imagine he's got less hair than me less hair, less hair. how is that even possible <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry i have what's called a horseshoe a very established horseshoe right okay you've been to see a hair transplant specialist you've never <laughs> I didn't mean to give that away. I didn't know. I was like, right. that's why, that's why I stopped you're gonna, Don't edit that out. If you edit that out, I will spam you in the comment section, all right? Okay. As nice as the Tiger is and as elegant as it is, I think we've okay. got to stay. He likes a big car. So right, I think, okay. So, what, what? I mean, we've got plenty right. for you to see here. Let's jump out. Yeah, and you let's can do give that. me a talk. Okay, cool. We're going to start where we left off. SVR. SVR. Not <laughs> not any normal standard SVR though. Full carbon, full urban, fully tuned, interior retrim. With a little bit of the sweat from the Yanomai's GT. The, this is the no. car that I personally did 2,000 miles in. So where's the hair gel? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> sure, watch out for And we're going to hit the road because Ben is still, still Steve. It's still yeah, we're still drilling. The, the guys at Urban are just working incredibly hard. We're really, really busy doing which scaffolding, is a, which is a great problem to have. But no, they're building, building cars, Amazing. building cars. <laughs> so yeah, we're going to go on a little bit of a drive, and whilst doing that, I think we should then discuss other options. Talk about what else you have in stock, because I mean, I don't want to talk about it right now. But there is the most stunning Defender I've ever seen in my life <laughs> that we're just driving past. We'll come back to it. Um, and you also said that you need to get some petrol. Just need to get some petrol. Which but that goes against like everything no, he don't, wants. Yeah, don't don't yeah. tell him that. Don't tell him. Just say it's a hybrid. And then every time he goes, like, just no, because then he's going to go home. Look, listen, he'll try and plug listen, something into no, it. No, listen. You're going to have to do your job as a good son, and just before he like, if he leaves for work at like eight o'clock in the morning, just go out at like seven o'clock in the morning. Just okay. put, the, put a little bit of fuel in. Hell, this, this, thing doesn't, though, yeah. this doesn't use much fuel. But oh, will I'm sure I parked no, it up with half a tank, <laughs> and it's got three quarters. But hopefully he wins it. I'll explain. That's the battery. 
that's battery, the battery charge, charge and then you get the mile yeah that's because he only needs he does like 100 miles each week from london to his house right from okay. work to home from buckingham palace to work <laughs> i didn't know how to phrase that. i was like how am i going to not give this away what's the difference between wins the castle and mayfair like oh. so just um just to brief you on this this car yeah um so this one's been tuned as well so it's got um approximately 620 brake horsepower <laughs> this is perfect this will get him to work okay. like, like that 620 brake horsepower custom exhaust That's i don't know if you've pitch. seen a standard svr interior but it's almost like they've got an umbro logo in them <laughs> no, yeah Are you, do you know what umbro know. is no no no, no you <laughs> i saw it in the documentary i think once about how the other I'm half lived. benefit yeah. street or something <laughs> you know one you know in, in I've got thing, no, up, no, no 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 <laughs> oh, it sounds like my Project 8! <laughs> okay, no, but come on, come right, on. Okay. But that, that was just in... That's the torque that of was, the battery. That was just in battery mode. Yeah. <laughs> the fuel light literally just came off from that. <laughs> So this is the new, Dad, if you're watching, this is the new... Hybrid. Charging. Yeah, it's liquid battery. Li yeah, uh, nitro... Uh. Right, now that we have recharged... Recharged. I think let's let's hit the road and let's talk about a few other options because I feel like he's going to see through the SVR push and plug. Again. And, and the thing is, even though you're now nearly the same age as my dad, um, I think <laughs> I so nearly just breezed past that, and I was so scared. I was just ready. Yeah. Um, I think this is a bit more you. I mean, you just spent uh, what felt like a month, according to social media, in this car. The amount of pictures you posted, I just felt like the animized GT never ended. Um, it yeah. was all. It was awesome. It was so, so, so good. But, it looked um, amazing, and yeah. I get why you love this. But I think yeah, let's go back and, and consider some of the other cars oh, because. Oh my god, this thing is so quick! Okay, I've got a GoPro on the roof. <laughs> oh yeah! <laughs> I think they're only speed tested to well, 70 that was very, miles that was an very hour. quick to 70. To 70, I think that's what they're speed tested to, so I just didn't want to go 71 in case. Yeah, of course. Um, so yes, we talked about very briefly the Defender. Which is which was part next to the So SBR. cool. So the what is that? Is that a, is that something you've done, or is that a car that you found? Because that I've never seen that come on the Defender. So we we source um, low mileage, good quality Defenders, and we build them to urban specifications. So um, with that one, that was um, a colour called Envy Green that we made, um, and it's yeah. I mean, it looks military, it looks cool, and it's that that mix of classic and modern all together which is which is just perfect can i take you back to to some of your favorite days of my life uh, when i was in my band riot park um and uh, us what when i was in my we've no, I'm not, I'm not, no, I knew you was in a band, like some, some, some made in Chelsea, feather in your ear. I did have so a, I, can you see it? No, honestly. Yeah, piercing, I had a piercing. Literally, but I never, you, did, you never disclosed the name. Oh, Riot Park, as in there's a riot in the park. And Chelsea, come. The, a riot in Chelsea Park, what did someone not pick up their, their dog poo or something like that, what a riot. Well, no, actually it came from that because somebody had a protein like smoothie, like a matcha green protein smoothie that they dropped and it was so annoying because I had a friend called Cressida and she was leaving her house once and stepped right in this like matcha green shape. It's, it's funny isn't it, like it, where, where you grew up, you know people Tread in, in dog poo. Where I grew up, it dog, wasn't a dog, dog poo. It was a matcha shape. Right. Okay. Yeah. Where I where I grew up, you know, dogs would tread in human poo. <laughs> it's, it's it's like where it's did a you very, grow up? Very different scale. Okay. Sure. Um, well. Okay. Okay. So let me go back. Right. Because please you know, do. In my, I'd love to hear when about I was it. rock and rolling. Uh, I was also uh, the like the sort of. I was going to say groupie, but that's not for my own brand. No. The road. You probably, you probably so, were a groupie of your own band. You probably were. Yeah, there was a lot so, of self-love going self on there. I, I bet. I was nineteen, so you know, it makes sense. But yeah, I was a, I was the roadie, so I used to carry all the like the drums and the amps and the, the musicy stuff. And I used to use my family's Defender. My dad and my whole family used to have a Defender. Yeah. Like the rock, and so that's what I used to use. Yeah. I, I drove into London once, full of gear. And I had that classic like Land Rover slash classic car situation of it not starting. So there I am, this kind of like yuppie, like trying to be like a gritty indie rock and roller. My defender's not starting. And so I lean out the window and there's a group of builders. Right. 
And so I'm like, okay, I'm sure they, these guys, they're gonna know what to do. Yeah. They go, yeah, what well, mate? Who you got here? Oh, the old, the old gas guzzler is causing you issues, eh? Just, just like that. Just like that. And so obviously I'm like, I'm so sorry. I don't think the choke is working properly. Could you help me start the car? And they all laughed. And they all laughed and they left. Yeah. And I was I was by myself, stranded. So I have a little bit of a bit of... How long have we known each other now? Maybe about four years? Four years, four, five four, five years, five years, yeah. years yeah. yeah. And every time, I mean, you know, hopefully your viewers would have seen the videos that we've done before and, you know, we... You know, we, we, we get on and, you know, I'd, I'd like to call you a, a, a friend of mine. It's so emotional when you say that. But it is, isn't it? It's, it's a... Get off. No, get, get off me. Get... There's something very comforting because I've been but, away so long. No, but I, every time we see each other, I still wonder how we're friends. Why we're friends. Let's get back to get the back task to the cars. Hand. Let's get, get back, back to the cars. cars so, the task so, so do you think SVR is fully out of the question? SVR is out. Forget that. Right? And as so, beautiful as that defender is, he already has a defender. Yeah. And he's talking about doing. But can he bring that to you? Absolutely. By the way? If he yeah. just wants to do like he just a said, interior and, and some you know, we, we, you know, we, um, we look after everyone. We accommodate everyone. Whether you just want a, a DRL bumper, whether you just want wing mirror caps, or you want a full bespoke build with interior, we will do anything. The Hello. next car that I was going to mention, Go on. the Discovery Five commercial. What's that? It's on, so Range Rover Sports and Vogue's are always our most popular vehicles at, at Urban's. You know, yeah. they're our, our bread and butter vehicles along with the Defenders. Uh, Land Rover released the Discovery Five commercial, which is a two-seater van. It's an M1 rated oh, commercial vehicle. Of course. Of course you are now pitching a van. How have you got away with this? You're like, oh, I've got just the car for you. It's a Ferrari that's been converted into a van. You've got to hear me out. It's Dragon's Den. You've got, you got 10 seconds. Go on. Discovery 5 commercial. VAT. Get it back. N1 rated commercial vehicle. It's a van. Oh my God, it literally is. It's literally a van. So you've got your loading area at the back, but it looks like a, a cool... Do you have one of these as your personal bike. car? I, 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 I will do one day, they're brilliant. <laughs> You'd be tempted, <laughs> wouldn't you? I'd, I'd absolutely be tempted. You know, Land Rover do a fantastic job, but I think they made a mistake on this. Oh. What we do is centralise it. If you're anything like me and my OCD, everything has to be symmetrical. So we centralise that. We How have you actually done that? That's not a new tailgate. It's a new panel. It's a new panel here. That's yeah. pretty good. But we're even, That's quite impressive. Yeah, <laughs> like, like the Defenders, um, you don't have to have the full kit, the, the full wheels. If, if you've got a Discovery 5 and you do just want your plate centralised, we can do that as well. Thank you so much for wasting me and my dad's time. <laughs> it's been amazing checking out the new urban automotive HQ. This place is so impressive. It's cool. As a place to work, you must oh, love it's a, it here. It's, yeah, it's yeah. absolutely. I mean, you know, I was a big fan of the brand before I even worked here. So to be able to walk through those doors every morning, it's a, cool. it's a blessing. So um, yeah, yeah, if anyone's seen anything on the on the video that um, that you're interested in, cars or accessories, just. You know, as long as it's not that green defender, because that's mine. That's yours, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. Right. Uh, awesome, yeah. Oh no, my car's over there. Tap me down, no, so I want to find you wallet. Sorry, no, right? <laughs>